All right, what's up, guys? So, not not too long ago, I almost said a while ago, but not too long ago, I posted a video on how I was overall going to stop doing um, or taking any reaction requests. And shout out to everybody that, you know, was showing support. I really do appreciate that. Um, even like, you know, joining my streams and then showing support in there. I do appreciate that too. So shout out to you guys. Y'all know who you are. Um, but there were uh, some people that did get mad about it. And I was like, there's one guy. I remember he left like this old like dumb paragraph long comment. But he always like le likes to leave comments like overall trying to like start arguments with me and stuff. And I'm just, you know, I'm not, that's not what I'm here for. I've said that numerous times. I'm not here to argue with people. I'm not an arguing YouTuber. No, I am an entertainer. I upload videos to entertain people. I don't upload videos to argue with people. So when I upload that video, I wasn't seeking an argument. I'm just letting people know like, hey, this is the situation going on with my channel. Just letting y'all know that. All right. So Anyways, but yeah, that guy, I remember even a while ago, he was trying to like get me to stop reacting to one of my friends' channel. And I'm like, okay, who do you think at the end of the day, who, who would you listen to at the end of the day? A person that you don't know that's only like leaving like hateful comments, like, you know, saying like, oh, like he, cause even when he left his last comment on the, um, the video where I said I wasn't going to do reaction requests anymore, dude was just being like, he was just being arrogant at the end of the day. He act like he had like some priority or some like, you know, ownership on my channel. I'm like, bruh, you, you can kindly, not even kindly, you can trip and fall, do whatever, but you do not have to be here. I'm saying, because you always like comment when you want to say something negative. You don't comment on my comedy skits. You don't comment on my music. You don't comment on, on any of the other videos. You only comment on the videos that like makes you upset, that has you feeling a certain way. So that should be a sign in your thick skull that, hey, maybe I should stop watching this guy. I'm saying, but anyways, but he would, yeah, dude was like left a whole arrogant comment like this last time around on the, the video where I said I wasn't going to do reaction requests anymore, but, um, but no, like, yeah, then, you know, my friend, I'm like, fam, like, I'm, I'm not listening to you overall, like, I'm doing the opposite of what you're telling me and stuff, so I, I think that should be a clear sign, like, hey, I'm not hearing you on this, <laughs> so anyways, but no, that guy, like, I blocked him because he was just being toxic. I'm like, nah, it's people like you. It's like, you make it worse for a YouTuber. It's like, you saying that it's going to be worse for me because I'm saying that I'm not going to take any reaction requests no more. It's like, no, you make it worse for a YouTuber. Like, honestly, there's probably people that don't quit because of him. But no, but so in case people didn't catch it and didn't really fully understand what I was saying. So the reason why I made that video is because I was getting tired of people promoting other content creators in my comment sections. Like, imagine how you feel if you post a video and it's a video that has absolutely nothing to do with that content creator. Let's say you post a video like, so let's say if you do reactions, right? And then, you know, there's probably some people that are out there that subscribe from that channel to your channel and stuff. And you decide that, hey, you know what, I'm going to post a video, a vlogging video, or I'm going to post a, a gaming video or a makeup tutorial or whatever you want to post and things. You post this video. You you love making that video. You're, you're, that video entertained you. But this person comes to your channel and says, hey, such and such just uploaded the video. I'm like, all right, well, I'm just letting you know I am subscribed. So, but my thing is this. I've said it in numerous videos where I'm subscribed to Big Nasty. Okay, I've shown it that I'm subscribed to Big Nasty. I'm subscribed to The Do. I'm subscribed to literally everybody that will be in my comment sections promoting these content creators and stuff. I'm subscribed to them. I know when they upload, okay? I follow these guys all across social media. So guess what? If I don't see it on YouTube, I'll see it on the social media platform. So at the end of the day, why are people even leaving comments about that in, um, in the first place? I'm saying like that type, especially if I'm getting notified from like literally every platform out there. Why are you like, I'm saying like the comments should just be a place where you just talk on the video that you clicked on. I, I don't, my thing is, is that even, and that's like, okay. So my thing is this, imagine if I post a big nasty reaction video, right? And I don't say nothing the whole video. 
And then I go and say, oh, I upload the video on my gaming channel. Go check that out. And I just leave it at that. That's the only thing that I say in the video. People will hate that. I know people will hate that on um, video. They're like, who cares about your gaming channel? Who cares about what you posted on there? I know people would say that. Even I would say that. <laughs> like, I'm saying, but people don't understand that. They want to be so quick to argue. They want to be so quick. So that's why I'm like, look, if you guys feel a certain way, feel a certain way. But that's how it's just going to be. So I'm saying, like, people get mad about that type of stuff. I'm like, okay, well, you be a content creator, you know. You you have 38 YouTube diff- um 38 different YouTube channels, a podcast, TikTok, and you're trying to promote all these different platforms, and then people want to be like, oh, such and such, upload a new video. Like, even the one guy that was just, you know, him just being, like, super toxic and stuff, and it was, like, trying to, like, drive me away from my own friends and things. I'm like, man, the, him being the most toxic out of them all and stuff. Like, I didn't even realize who he was until the uh, last second and stuff. And I was like, oh, wait a minute. That was that guy. I was just like, he was on my case a while ago. And I was like, man, you, it's people like that. I'm like, you guys, y'all ain't making content creating any better. I'm like, so that's why I said, I'm like, I'm just going to do my own thing. I ain't going to worry about what people say, what people do. I'm like, hey, it's like, you know, if I lose a subscriber, I've said that before and I'll say it again. I lose a subscriber, like, I'll gain a subscriber. So I'm like, there's going to be somebody out there that, you know, sees what I'm saying. There's going to probably be a lot more people that understands and sees what I'm saying versus people that is like, oh, you know what? Instead of seeing it from his point of view, let me just go ahead and argue with him because that seems like the smart thing to do. That seems like what everybody wants to do. I'm like, look, this ain't a channel i don't know why i'm sweating and stuff i'm like it, you know i did i didn't got high i should have taken this hoodie off but anyways um this ain't a channel for arguing like i'm done with that like at the end of the day all i want to just you know really focus on like i don't even like the fact that i'm sitting down recording this video but at the end of the day all i want to do is just entertain my fans like if you want to say that i don't have a lot of fans okay whatever if you want to say that i have a lot of fans okay cool I'm not here to argue with people. I'm not here for the drama. I'm not here for the beef. I don't care about nobody that makes videos about me. I don't care about none of that, okay? If it's some positive stuff, all right, cool. But if you want to be negative, if you want to be toxic, you want all of that other extra stuff, I'm like, you go on your own platform and do that, okay? Don't come to my platform and do that. I'm like, because the the stuff is it's going to get deleted and you're going to get blocked, all right? So it's like, you can feel however you want to feel about this, but I'm like, that's how I feel. This is my channel, all right? I should be able to have a say-so on my own channel, the channel I created, the channel I can very well take down if I feel like it and stuff. But yeah, it's just, you know, there's people out there that don't really understand that, and they think that they have some ownership just because they clicked subscribe. And I'm like, just because you subscribe to Net- um, Netflix, that don't mean that you own it. Just because you subscribe to HBO Max, don't mean that you own it. Just because I'm like trying to think of some other, just because you subscribe to somebody's OnlyFans don't mean that you own them. They have a right to post and say whatever they want to post and say. It's like, as they, I just feel like it's like, you know, you subscribe, you subscribing for all for it all. So that's how I feel. So anyways, I, you know, I don't know why people are mad, but, you know, I just think it's like a lot of them are just, you know, they're not content creators or they're just not overall seeing it from my point of view. So I'm like, until you see it from my point of view, it's like, look save your arguments and all that crap to yourself but anyways i will talk to you guys later thank you guys for watching stay tuned for the next video like subscribe if you're new to the channel and peace